Darn it. I had two diamonds. All right, quick. Yeah, I'm going to try to make some armor real quick. Oh, that enderman's still down here. Luckily, okay. I already have an iron yeah. sword, iron axe. Oh, that is a giant lava lake. Cool. Take some big potatoes. And then we're going to need an iron pickaxe. Another iron axe, I guess. All right, go. I guess this is really just a everybody keeps dying video, huh? I, I don't know about that. The real question is, am I going to be able to find my way back to there? <laughs> oh. oh, he blew up again. No, nope, not that way, David. I'm not seeing any more diamonds, like, that are... Not even any of the roof. <laughs> the skeleton hit the... Uh, Enderman. It's funny. Me. Let's see. Over here. Oh, I forgot I can zoom. Yes. But there was like five zombies there, including one that was on a chicken. It was very rude using a chicken like that. Mm -hmm. So it's kind of roughly over there somewhere. The spider is kind of funny. Keeps bouncing around. I'm not looking at you, Andy Mendy. I learned my lesson. Oh, geez. I don't have any torches. You need better armor soon. Oh! Diamonds in the ceiling. Four. Oh, I see more. Yay. Alright, zombies. Let me kill you so I can get these diamonds. Not over there. Is I still down there? Yes, this is where I was. Apparently no zombies stuck around to kill me. All right, what do we have? Two diamonds. That's really all I care about. And I got my pumpkin pie back. Yeah, you know, and part of the problem, unfortunately, was, uh, I hate to admit this, but um, my stone sword broke in the middle of that fight. It kind of was <laughs> one of those situations where eh, if I had been using a, a rock sword or uh, an iron sword, maybe I wouldn't have had this problem. Mm -hmm. And it's painful to admit that. It really is. I don't think I deserve any of that skeleton. Thank you. 
Might as well pick up some of this iron. Even if it's not a whole lot. Just Why can't I it. find my way out of here? <sighs> Creeper. Alright, I just want to get back to the surface. I just don't want to lose my diamonds. Work too hard for these. Another one of those glow things. Yeah, I'm really not looking forward to going anywhere near those shriekers, but um my sense of adventure is a little too strong. I don't know. Mostly because those mobs keep setting off the stupid sensors. Alright. Back home, please. At some point I should make this cave a little bit easier to navigate this hole back and back and back and back and back. It's really kind of annoying. But it just seems like so much work. It's a lot of cave. I feel like in some cases it's better to uh you know, it's nice to be able to easily traverse the cave, but some caves aren't worth it, depending on how deep they go and, and what they lead to. This one led to several diamonds. I would say that's worth it. Of course, I didn't know it until today. These mobs near the sensors and the streakers are making me very anxious. Don't really want an encounter with the warden. I just watched that creeper spawn. What the heck? Another arrow. Two. Okay. Maybe it is. Go back to the surface and deposit my goodies before I die again. It's good that you've accepted that you're gonna die again. Well, I don't really need it like spawning a warden. Um and then having that kill me, because then I won't be able to get back to my stuff. <laughs> Fair. So I nine. There's lava. We'll be up to the surface in a few minutes. That's okay. I'm just gonna fall asleep to the sweet sounds of zombies. Yeah, I mean, six diamonds, or eight? Eight diamonds. I have eight diamonds. It's pretty good. I don't want to hear about it. <laughs> All right, so I need some obsidian if I'm going to make a crafting table then. Because that's the only thing I don't really have the materials for. What, the enchantment table? Yeah. And I suppose if I need obsidian, I'm going to need to be able to break it, in which case I need a diamond pickaxe anyways, right? Right. Honestly, it's it, it's usually the first thing people make when they get diamonds, um, because it lets you get other things. Um, the diamond pickaxe or the diamond... Uh, the enchantment table? Diamond pickaxe. Um, oh. And then enchantment next depending on priorities um i personally really like making like because i was still on the the hunt for more diamonds i was okay with making the enchantment table because it actually let me get fortune one enchant so i could get more diamonds so it really depends um 
like if you have enough diamonds to make either a pickaxe or an enchant table, but you don't have the setup to get full 30, it's not really worth it. Um, at least in my opinion, because you're not going to get any good enchants. I mean, what do I need for books? I need leather and paper. Yep. I know you have a sugarcane farm. You will just need a cow farm. All right. I guess I can make a cow farm, sure. Yeah, I should feed like my cows. I don't need them for leather anymore because I have full set up, but um, I do like the steak that they give me because it's the best. Other than golden carrots, golden carrots are actually the the best food item to use, but you you can get those from uh villagers. So are we not sleeping? It's now daytime. Oh, it is. Yeah. Oh. You waited too long. I was making my <laughs> the surface. Thank you very much. Well, if you're at the surface, you would know that it's daytime now. I have nine diamonds. I'm so excited. I have four. And I'm going to use three of them to make a diamond pickaxe. Which I will then leave in my... Actually, there was obsidian down at the bottom of that hole. And I didn't see any lava around it. But I just need to dig around it to make sure there's no lava down there. Is that the way it works? Like dig around below it? Well, what you could do is put down, a, a, like, have a water bucket with you and put down a water source. Um, so, it, so it's kind of like pushing you, so you're like, you're in the water. Um, so that if when you break the obsidian, there is lava underneath it, the water will turn it into more obsidian. That's honestly the safer well, way to do it. There's, there's water pouring onto it already. I, I could dig down onto it safely. It's a question of if I dig down into it and there's lava below it, will the obsidian get burned from... If it drops into it, yeah. Yeah. But if you're standing close enough, you're, like, it should, like, your person should pick it up before it drops into the lava, depending on how far away from it you are. All right. I, I think I would like to do that instead of hunting for... For, uh, cows at the moment. I think that would just be more fun. Yeah, good luck with the obsidian because it takes forever to mine. No, I know. Mm -hmm. uh, apparently I already have two pieces of obsidian too, so I actually am not that far. Good. But if I have enough to do that plus make a portal, that'd be nice. How many how many pieces do I need for a portal? Um, you need at least ten. Ten? So three, ten. three, and then two at top, two on bottom? Um, but, so that's not in, in, including the corners. Um, corners will be four, uh, 14 total pieces. Okay. But you can make portals any size you want. Um, I think it needs to be... Could you make a 2x2? Two two? You might be able to. I'm not really sure. Um, but I think you can like make them as big as you want and whatnot. Okay. Alright, pumpkins. Don't fail me now. No! Get back in there. Oh my gosh, no. Hang on. So we've got about... Wait a minute. I didn't get any of my armor when I died. Because they killed me? Is that what's happened? Or maybe they stole my armor? The vicious zombies that they are? Do I, th I think I might set up a Fletcher. I think I might set up a Fletcher. I, I really want to get a, a decent source of arrows so I can use them. Ow. But first, I'm going to make a diamond pick. And then... Make like a, my first piece of diamond armor. Must be nice. Oh, did not oh, die. I, sword's almost dead. Let me let me make a diamond one. Maybe I'll make. Oh, 
Um, I can make you a pair of We'll do that. All right. Cool. We now have. Anyway, so we probably have somewhere in the 15 to 20 minute range here. Okay. So plan your delving accordingly. Yeah. I'm going to set up a flashing villager, I believe. Um, Shh. I think that's the plan. I'm going to set up large trees to cut down so I have ample supply of wood. Yes. Oh shoot, what did I do? What did you do? Well, I muted myself to talk with Kelly for a minute, but then I accidentally killed my board. It's fine. We're good. We're good. All right. Yeah, I think I'm going to try digging underneath this and just see. Just see if there's any lava underneath it. Yeah. Yes, there is. <laughs> Of, you know, sort of, uh, All right, so let's put that back. See if that's enough to get the trees growing. I need to find a Fletcher. Make a flashing table. There we go. Those are going to grow. Oh well. Oh, duh, bamboo. What am I doing? Duh. I don't know what you're doing. Bamboo is the best way to get sticks. And I seem to have forgotten that. That's all. Ah, gotcha. This seems safe. It grows super fast and um, you're able to make sticks with them and it's just the most efficient way of getting sticks for stick trades. All right, let's go see if I can find a uh, fletching villager. Oh, let me make a table first, because I don't know if there's going to be one over there. Better idea. Better idea. Oh, oh. What'd you, <laughs> what'd you do? Nothing. Nothing. Everything's fine. Everything is fine. I didn't catch on fire. I didn't burn. It's fine. All right, I think... 
Make that spot safe. Mm, I think I need the touching table. I wish I could see progress on this. Is it go? not? There it is. Okay. Let me go get a clutching village. So I can maybe. Oh, it is running night. Sleepy. Oh, I actually have my bed with me conveniently enough. Um... Yeah, I. I have a second one somewhere. I just keep forgetting to um, use it. I don't have any place where I can put it down. <laughs> One moment, let me dig a hole. <laughs> there we go. Cool. Alrighty. So I should be able to dig that one out. Oh, the iron golem is uh, a little burnt, a little crispy. It's a little damaged. Okay. All right. Oh, the uh, librarian in here, hey, buddy. What do you uh, you sell? Shelves. Okay. Um. What we're gonna do well this is going just perfectly let me tell you oh get back in there no er. go back into your house thing Alright, I need to find a villager that does not have a job. Oh! And you're not a nitwit. Let's see if I can just lure him up here. Let's see if anybody comes to claim it. you. Go back. Go back. Go get the fletching table. No. No. Alright. Did I pick it up already? I did. A Fletcher. Come here. Um. Come on. All right, maybe mining for obsidian is not as riveting as I thought it was going to be. <laughs> Told you. I know, I know. Will one of these villagers please take the fletching table? Dude. Come 
here. Nine. All right. So I need ten plus Gosh, four, and I already had two. So like two more, maybe. Come here, buddy. I have to say, this is just working out lovely, even if slow. Yep, you're telling me. All right, so I've got 11. I, no, I need 12, David. 12. Um, can you actually give me the trait that I want, please and thank you? No. I know, that's never, that's not, that's never how it works. Okay. All right. Well, if I ever need more obsidian, I know where to find it. Um, now let's go up. Well, that could have been horrible. Good job, David. That's what I wanted. Thank you. What a deal. What deal did you get? Stick or emeralds. You traded a stick for emeralds? 32 sticks for an emerald. Well, now 51 because he gave me a discount. Er oh, he, no. What? What? 50? Why did you do that? <laughs> Why did you do that? I didn't hit you. Why did you do that? <laughs> Sounds like quite the discount. <laughs> did I, did I flood the market? Is that what happened? Maybe they don't want any more sticks. Well, he's getting them, whether he likes it or not. This is me failing at jumping. It's fine. No, that's so funny. He gave me a discount on everything else that he's trading, except for the sticks. He was like, no, you have to pay 50 now. I'm just gonna walk away. I already got an enough. Um, like arrows. Dude, you're so rude. So rude. You're the one that's upset that you can't give him an infinite number of sticks. Yes. I'm allowed to be rude about that. These villagers really need to crawl on top of the houses. How do they get hurt? They're dumb and they jump off of high places. Alright, well, why don't you please become a. Um, librarian, please. Okay. Um, I'm going to leave that there. So yeah, I got my arrows. I set up a trade with the um, villagers, which is pretty exciting. Now I have... Well, I honestly, to make it cheaper, what I really should do is zombify them and uh, heal them again. Um, or, like, heal them, but I don't really have gold, like enough golden apples or um, blaze powder. I would have to go to the <laughs> nether before I do that. Are you kidding me? I need another diamond. Why? <laughs> What'd you do? I'm like trying to make this uh, this enchanter table, and I'm like, why is it not working? You need two. I need two. <laughs> I thought I told you that. You probably did. You know me. I also forgot the book, but that was a different issue. <laughs> you need one book. Well, I have a book. I just didn't put it in the crafting table. 
Well, that's unfortunate. Good job. Guess I need to go find some more diamonds before I can enchant things. All right. Are you at a good stopping point that you can uh, step away, or uh, I suppose yeah. I could just leave the world open if you're not. I, it's fine. No, give me two seconds to finish what I'm doing, um, sure. and I'll be pop off. So That's just fine. a couple of minutes. I'll go visit Hey Hey while I wait. All right. Um, yeah, I'm just trying to see something real quick. Finding Hey Hey is ridiculously difficult. Hmm. There you are, Hey Hey. These these chickens are prolific egg layers. Let me tell you. In fact, I think it's about time to make some more pumpkin pie. All right. Well, um, I'm gonna head out. Um, I had a blast playing. Um, hopefully, we can do this again later this week. Um, thank you, everybody, for joining the stream. Um, yeah. I'm, I couldn't really read comments. Um, I will have my iPad up next time, so I'm able to <laughs> be. In. Um, yeah. Bye, everyone. All right. Thanks, Gwen. Of course. All right. Well, everybody, I hope you had a good time today. I certainly did. I can't find my buttons. It's wonderful. There we are. Hi, everybody. Uh, so, yeah. Usual stream tomorrow, uh, starting 6.30 Eastern. Um, Wednesday is a no stream day. I don't have uh, time to stream that day. Got a doctor's appointment. And then Thursday and Friday, we're actually going to have a little bit of a different setup. I'll probably start fairly late, um, but it'll depend on the weather and how things go. So we'll see. Uh, let's see here. We have Realities Lens and Futures Lens. They're out now. Uh, you can check them out at those respective locations. Um, I have a blog, which I will probably post to tonight. I'm switching to a weekly cadence on that. We'll see how that works. Uh, you're very welcome, Darth. Thanks for hanging out. Uh, I have a YouTube channel. That's where some of these videos end up, uh, as well as the shorts of me dying, um, as well as other things I think are funny. Uh, I have a Discord. You can connect with me there. You can connect with me over at the TWN Discord or just in general on Discord. Um, same name here as there. Uh, that's going to do it for me. Let's find someone to raid. When I raid, I generally say raid, raid, and read. You can do that or not as you please. And as always, thanks for hanging out today. Terrible Novelist is out there. Seems like a good place to start. So we'll do that. All right. Um, I don't remember if I said uh, you don't need to apologize for lurking, Darth, but you certainly don't. You're welcome to lurk. Please, please lurk if you want to. <laughs> All right. Uh, yeah, be good to yourselves, be good to others, and I hope to catch you in the future. Thanks for hanging out, everybody. Have a great day. Of every good of every good character and then go from there but okay